Rich Tarani. We're at IT Expo 2020, the Tech Super Show. We're in Fort Lauderdale, sunny Fort Lauderdale, I should say. Uh, look who's with us. It's Jim Maki. He is with uh, Sangoma. How are you? Hey, Rich. How you doing? It's good to be here again. Good to see you. Fantastic. This is our, uh, I don't know, our double-digit interviews. We've been doing these for years and years, and I'm yeah. so excited yeah. to talk to you. So much going on. Yeah. So um, first, let's talk about Digium, what's happening. Yeah. There was an acquisition a while back. Yeah, so about 18 months ago in September 2018, uh, Sangoma acquired Digium. Um, everything's going good with that. There was some concern in the channel about our UC products, PBX and SwitchFox, about whether they would both continue, and I think that's all resolved now. People see that they're both going to be there. We've been continuing to invest in both of them, and um, they, they serve different markets, so, so that's all behind us now, so that's really good. Great. You also had another acquisition of uh, VoIP Innovations, yeah. and how's that going? So VoIP Innovations was this past October, so only only a few months ago. Um, we are investing in their SIP trunking. They have wholesale SIP trunking, and that's going really well. And so uh, we, we expect to be able to grow that market. And then also they have AppaDay as a CPaaS platform. So we're working to bring AppaDay's better onto Asterisk and free PBX so that we can enhance the ecosystem of apps that are available on those platforms. That's our primary uh, focus right now, and then we'll do more with AppaDay's over time. But right now, that's what we're going to do. So that's great for the community, right? Yeah. I mean, just uh, they'll have more... Uh more tools, more solutions that they'll have access to. Yeah, we're actually doing a hack, a TAD, TAD hack mini with and giving prizes for Apidays and Asterisk, and then there'll be a big prize if someone writes Apidays and Asterisk together. So, so it's really good for the community. That's why we're doing it. Yep. Do you see a lot more M&A happening? Um, well, as you know, you always ask me that question. In fact, just yesterday, we announced the intent to acquire a company called E4. Uh, that'll beef up our sales and marketing in the free PBX and PB Exact in the open source community area. So we're really excited about that. And uh, yesterday here at this event, we actually had a free PBX and, and asterisk sort of uh, advisory council uh, that lasted all day and it was, it was a really good meeting. So we really, we really are investing in the community because we want that to grow and it'll be good for everybody. Great. You were um, one of the uh, most important faces at Dialogic for years and years. Uh, what are your thoughts on the uh, recent sale? Yeah, so Dialogic was sold to Inch House just, I don't know, a month ago. Um, you know, to me that was inevitable, uh, given, given where the owners wanted to take it. So, uh, so I'm, I'm happy for all those guys. I hope they all, you know, do well at Inch House. Fantastic. It's a good time in the market. I mean, there are lots of growing areas, so hopefully that works out for them. Uh, and the next question I have is just what are you showing here at the event? What's new? What are some of the exciting things happening? So IT Expo has always been good for Sangoma. Um, we did well last year with um, our cloud, getting leads for cloud. So we're actually in the MSP part of the, part of the event, and we expect to get some good leads for cloud. So we're actually showing our cloud solutions here, SIP trunking, SwitchFox Cloud, our, our UC cloud platform. So that's, that's what we're doing here. Great, so tar primarily targeting uh, resellers, channel, MSPs, uh, end users as well, like if I'm a small business, can I go direct to you guys? Um, they can come talk to us for sure, but we wouldn't, you know, we'd go to our channel, like we, we want to, um, you know, we, the channel's important to us, so we'll, we'll just bring them to somebody who can take care of them, reseller uh, better for them, so that's what we'll do. Is there anything else we should know? No, not today, Rich. So uh, How do people find you? Just find me on LinkedIn. I write a blog. I continue to write the blog. Uh, I'm pretty active out there, so people can find me. Fantastic. Thanks for being here, right, Jim. Rich. Thank you.